Hey guys, so I've been getting a lot of questions asking about how I put my hair up in uniform. You might think it's self explanatory, but maybe it's not. Maybe those people are curious about the products I use. I don't know. In boot camp, I had one female RDC. She didn't teach us jack shit about doing our hair. Obviously, products I used then were different than what I use now. Fresh out the shower hair, it's damp. My shirt gets all wet sometimes. It happens, it really doesn't bother me. So I use Aussie Kids Bloom and Apple Detangular. Detangular? I have a lot of hair. It's curly, it's thick. I have to do my hair wet. I can't put it up when it's dry. It just doesn't hold like it should. When you come out of boot camp, your RDCs tell you like, don't be a shit bag, like hold your standards up and what have you. Bro, there's a lot of like fucked up looking people, especially like females in their hair. So it's not really hard to do your hair well. I don't know, people, I don't know. So I'm gonna spend, you know, a few minutes brushing all the fucking tangles out. All right, now that we've done that, told you, super self-explanatory. Um, I used to only part my hair on the left side, then I was convinced I was going bald, so I started parting it on the right side. So I'll really part my hair on both sides, it just kind of depends on the day. Today we're gonna go for the left, and then this is where we put it up. So the regular, like normal size hair ties don't work for my hair, they, my hair's so dense, it just, they snap. So I use the big ones, they are a little bit larger, like if it's on my wrist, they kind of dangle. Obviously this one's like stretched out. It's probably gonna break, but we're gonna try. These even break on my hair all the time, so if you know of a really good fucking hair tie, let me know. I'm just gonna gather the hair if you've ever made a bun and a ponytail. Obviously it's all fucked up, so then I brush it. It is easier with like a large paddle brush than a smaller brush, in my opinion. Sorry if I'm coming off like fucking rude, but now that I'm actually doing this, I'm like, wow, this is really like, I get it's helpful. Maybe I'm just an asshole. Okay, I'm gonna stop being an asshole. All right, then I literally just wrap the hair around itself. I don't put a donut in my hair. I have before. Um, I'll get one out in a second and show you though. So then I just wrap the first one. I have to use two hair ties. One don't cut it, girl. I don't know if y'all can hear it, but colors is going off. <laughs> or the colors warning, my bed. So my bed looks a little different every time, like. But yeah, I don't know, maybe somebody watching this will be like, wow, no, your bun looks like shit. It's gotten me this far. So if you have like really short hair and you wanna start putting your hair up, they have donuts that are like this big. Like, I don't know where you find them. In A school, I tried using one, um, my friend had them but again, too much hair. So this is a regular size donut. So basically you put your hair in the ponytail and then I'll secure it. And then you just put the hair through this and then like you bend over and then you just fold the hair like this. And then you take an elastic, secure it like that. And then you wrap the rest, another elastic. Or now like the regs have changed. So you can literally use this big ass fucking donut in your head. It, it literally like covers the entire back of your head. My roommate bought this cause so she's Filipino, like she has thick ass hair and it's a lot longer than mine, but she's like, nah, like it's just too big. So what she does is she'll, when you tell her hair, braid her hair and then wrap it up. So that's another option. So yeah, once we're here, doing my hair only takes me a couple minutes. Obviously I'm not talking when I do it. So I've used a few different kinds of gels. The one I use now is the Super Sculpt by Paul Mitchell. It's very liquidy, but does it say what kind of hold it is? It just says fast drying. Um, I would say this is like a medium hold. I don't have any issues with it during the day. I can kind of brush it out at the end of the day. Well, in boot camp, in the little store, they had the Tresemme gel and then the Got To Be glued, I think it's called. It's yellow, it's by um, Bedhead, I wanna say, TG. The yellow one that I'm talking about, the bottle, that shit is like fucking glue. I'm pretty sure it's water activated. A lot of my friends used it. It was just too much for my hair. I like the Tresemme, but it doesn't really hold my frizz. But with that one, it's really easy to work out of your hair. And then this is my secret weapon. I used to work at a store, like a beauty retail store, and they had this line and now I buy it at Cosmoprof because I have my license. So again, it's my color proof. It's not a hairspray, it's um, a humidity spray. So it's called Humidity RX, anti-freeze water, not one weatherproof spray this stuff is amazing it literally holds my frizz all day i go a little ham on this i try not to like drown my roommate out when she's in here but it gets a little cloudy so i put it on my bun too Ooh, 
See, it's a little hazy in here. Some of you might say, wow, you use so much. It fucking works. My hair doesn't look like trash. There's colors. Anyways, that's how I do my hair. This is what it looks like again. If you think it looks like trash, I'm sorry. I disagree with you. I don't have any pants on. So I'm gonna go put on my pants and my boots, pack my lunch, and then go to work. Sorry if I was a dick, but I hope this was helpful. Talk to you guys later. <laughs>